There's a war going outside these walls. But inside, their only focus is on the front of the classroom. All together, they recite after their teacher. Yasmin is a shy third grader. She is one of the new students. I love this school very much. They teach me so many things. And I love my friends here. We are all very happy in this school. Most of the students' favorite lessons are Arabic. They say it's because they can understand the verses of the Quran. In this cold and cramped classroom, around 40 schoolgirls aged 10 to 12 are receiving an education. They're mostly from all around Idlib province, but some even from the newly evacuated eastern Aleppo region. Today's lesson is on religion. But like students from all around the world, they also receive lessons in math, history, geography, and physics. And after memorizing some verses, it's time for a short break. Children rush out of the classroom and into the yard. There isn't a playground here, just some empty space. It's cold outside. They get 10 minutes to stretch their legs and chat with their friends. And then it's time to go back inside. This school is a big improvement for many of the students, but safety can't be guaranteed. We try our best to give every student school books and stationery. But what we need most for our students is security. They are all afraid of warplanes. And while hundreds of students are being taught within the painted walls of this school, there are thousands more outside needing an education. Adi Janayandash, TRT World in the Idlib countryside.